What's going on, Shady People? Shady Penguin here. Welcome you back to the next video of Duel Links. Today, I have a PSA announcement. That's a public service announcement. Announcement before we get started. Uh, the Yugi Moto event has started, and you can see all the possible rewards right here that you can get. Um, I mean, the big one that you really want to focus on is Union Attack. It's not the ultra rare, it's super rare. But this card is really, really, really good for farming. It's basically better than uh, Ruryoku, because instead of taking half of one monster's attack, you can take all of the attack of your... Uh, fellow monster so if you have another Cerberus that's been gaining attack you just drop that right on top of it this is so good such a good card for farming to get that 10k damage uh I really want to lock this card Gandora the Dragon of Destruction cannot be special summoned you can pay half your life points destroy as many cards in the field as possible and if you do banish them this card gains 300 attack for each card destroyed this way once per turn hold on whoa 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 game my fingers are disobedient once per turn during the end phase of this card was normal or flip summoned send it to the graveyard what so it gets one big boost, and you better hope that they don't have Karibo in hand. Oh my gosh. All right. And the most you can really gain is uh, if the field is completely full. 6, 7, 21. So you can gain 21, 18, 30. You can have a 3,900 attack monster. And then all they do is Econ before you pop it. So that card is actually really, really bad. Maybe I won't worry about getting it. Just for collection reasons, I want to get it. Then you have Toy Magician. Uh, you can set this card face down in your spell or trap card zone as a spell card. If this, card, if this face down card in your spell or trap card zone is destroyed by an opponent's card effect and sent to the graveyard, special summon it during the end phase. When this card is flip summon, destroy all spell and trap cards on the field equal to the number of Toy Magicians on the field. Not a very good card in my opinion. It is a 16-15 light spell caster. So it does have a little bit of, of niche in that way um so uh, it's worth getting just because of that increase the life points of both players by 1000 points it's an interesting card uh magical blast if you control spellcaster type monster inflict 200 points of damage to your opponent for each spell cancer monster you currently control during your draw phase if this card is in your graveyard you can just add it to your hand wow so you could do spellcaster burn 600 damage each turn just over and over and over again i don't think that's gonna work out and then block man you contribute this card, special summon in defense position, a number of block tokens, equal to the number of turns this card has been facing on the field. I think it's an interesting card. Uh, if you let it live for a couple turns, um, you can get like three monsters out there, and then you can tribute some of those for, for one of the big boys that you need three monsters to tribute for. So, I think it, it's it's pretty interesting. Oh, look, they show you combos that you can do. Uh, you shallow grave, each player selects a monster in the graveyard and special summons it face down defense position. Powerful effect of Gandora the Dragon Destruction destroys and banishes every card in the field. Special summon double costin using the shallow grave. And then tribute it. That's that's all that's all it's saying. Is use double cost it. All right. Never mind. <laughs> there are other ways you could do that. But today I wanted to take a break from the Exodia duels, and I wanted to go ahead and do a little bit of memeing, uh, a little bit of uh, theme decks. I have another idea for a theme deck tomorrow that hopefully I can get together. But if you guys remember, if you haven't been around, I have a video uh, where I use this deck right here, which is basically just incredible, incredible effect damage to the deck, and it works really, really well. I called it Straps. Um, but today we're gonna be doing traps only dead meme traps only I don't know why this deck is named dead meme. I really have no idea. I didn't change the name But this is basically what I'm running right now uh, at first I wasn't running three jar of grease, but realistically the crutch of the deck is attack and receive so uh, I want to get to those as soon as possible uh, You run golden apples to get monsters in the field when your opponent attacks you directly You run clonings to get monsters in the field when your opponent attacks you directly Enchanted javelins to stay alive Fatal Abacus is definitely a interesting card. I haven't really tested it out too much, but when I can go like Golden Apples or Cloning and then Crash, it's great. It's an extra 500 life points of damage. So I'm going to go ahead and see how it goes today running one of those. Uh, the question is, are these Golden Traps? Because we are in Gold Rank 2 right now, and we're going to see if these Traps are indeed Golden. A new mug today for you guys, and you guys have been loving the mug features. Hmm. And I also took note, uh, I took my glasses off for this video because the light positioning right now is just too much glare. I got so many comments about the glare. It was the whole focus of yesterday's video. But I appreciate those comments nonetheless. Thank you so much for being active on the channel. I also have a muffin that I have banished myself from eating until I finish this video. Odin's threatening my, is there anything, anything more appropriate? Um, this is actually worst case scenario for us. This is actually worst case scenario for us. I just want you guys to understand that. As long as we're on the same page, going up against Mai is worst case scenario for us. Um, we do have a golden apple, so now I have to decide do we want golden apples, do we want a jar of greed? Uh, I mean, do we want a chant the javelin? We can have both of those, that's fine. I'm gonna go golden apples. I'm gonna go jar of greed. 
Uh, and I'm tempted to actually just throw down the fatal uh, abacus. Just in case, because realistically, all I'm going to want to do now is crash. Now that I know that she's running a Relinquish deck, and one card in her hand is a Relinquish, she just can't have a Harpy. Just no Harpy right now, and we're fine. No Harpy, and we're fine. No Harpy, and we're fine. That's fine. That's actually great. We don't get cloning off, which sucks. But we do. We are going to get our Golden Apples off. So let's go... Uh, no, I want to go Golden Apples. I don't want to activate Jar of Greed in the battle phase, because then you can Trap Jammer me. Well, you could trap jammer this anyway. So let's see. Do you have a trap jammer? Chain reaction, of course. That is the the whole point of this deck. Is each trap card does an extra 200 life points of damage to my opponent. So we can get we can get my opponent down to what 3600 right now. Actually, 3200. I'll wait to activate fatal Ab abacus. Uh, I keep calling it Acabus. I don't know why. I don't know what an Acabus is. It's not an abacus. All right, we got more golden apples, which is good and bad. We don't need to play golden apples yet because uh, we will just have um, cloning on the board regardless. So let's go ahead and let's attack. And let's activate. In the, in the battle phase, opposite of what I said before. Oh, listen to what I say, not what I do. We'll bring her down to 3,400. And then if this attack goes through, we'll actually bring her down even more so. We're going to see Metal Morph come through. Well, that's a shame. So our token is gone. I was considering putting Metal Morph into here because, like, you do get a lot of tokens from cloning and from golden apples. So it's like, it could be a good trap to run. It could be a good trap. Now, the whole thing is that I can only run traps in this deck. So maybe we will do that. Oh, it's some really good coffee. That is some actually delicious, actual delicious coffee. If I do say so myself. He's going to send another card. Where's my straight flush? Where's my straight flush? Okay, so unfortunately, we didn't set the golden apples when we could have and should have. But that's okay. Look at this. We're, we're at the life point lead by 500. That's it. Oh my gosh. Where's our... We need we need something. This is why there's a jar of greed. I knew I was going to draw jar of greed for some reason. That's really weird. Uh, let's set another golden apple and end our turn. Unfortunately. Uh, I, this is the one reason why I really don't like this card, Fatal Abacus. I don't like continuous spe traps. Oh, uh, no, you're gonna, you're, are you gonna get rid of that? Are you gonna get rid of the Abacus? I really hope you do. Or you target cloning. If you're smart, you target the newest card I just set, but you don't. So I'm gonna activate cloning. You can give us at least some sort of defense. Um, granted, it's sucky defense, but I have to burn this card. The reason why it's sucky is because uh, freaking Metamorph lets him get over all of my tokens no matter what. Man, this is like, this is literally worst matchup possible. This is the worst matchup possible. Wow. All right, well, I will have to activate Golden Apples here. I really wanted to activate it on... Um, I really wanted to activate it on the beautiful... 1700 attack, but that's not going to be the case. So we haven't seen a single attack and receive yet. We run three of them. Just another cloning, which there's literally no point in playing. Uh, I'm going to set Jar of Greed and Windstorm to stall for a turn. Uh, and I'm going to try to crash with the Harpy Lady. I actually wouldn't mind if we didn't crash. But we're going to see Windstorm of Atequa, which is fine. Not the end of the world. Uh, now, it'll, now it'll allow me to... Next turn, I'm going to have to activate my own Windstorm. Actually, we're probably going to see a Relinquish play here and suck me up. I'm going to get sucked right now, aren't I? I think I'm getting suckled. Unless you really didn't get it. Econ, oh, there we go. Econ attribute to summon the Sonic Bird to get the spell. Yep. Mm -hmm. I understand. Or you just use my token. Wait, why did, you, why did they just take damage? Oh, because... Oh, you right, you right, when you right, you right. Tribute to one of their monsters. Are you going for a game right now? Oh, you're going for a game. Oh, big mistake. Big mistake. You just played Windstorm. You got to play around it. The music changed and everything. She thought she had it. She, <laughs> she definitely thought she had it. Well, best part is now I can attack into the defense position. Uh, Seijin. Senju. Let's Seijin. Senju. And we'll be good. Ooh, finally attack and receive. We'll activate Jar Greed first, though. Bringing her down to 1,900. This deck is so much fun. 
Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and I am going to set attack and receive and mirror wall. I might regret not setting cloning, but it's okay. Let's see if we actually yes, we get this off. We get another fire and light. Okay, I, I like this card now. That's it's already done. It's already done what a thousand. It's already done at least a thousand. That's great. That's great. Mm. My turn. Neither can I. Nor this is like worst matchup possible. I thought we'd be done, though. This deck is fun. I'm not sure. Ah, oh, this is the worst. This is actually the worst. That's actually the worst that could have happened. Uh, the good news is, all we really have to do is draw another attack and receive. Now, of course, I think she's not unaffected by traps. Yeah. Relinquish is unaffected by traps now. Um, traps that target, I believe. Let me see. Uh, this card is unaffected. No, unaffected by traps in general. So Mirror Wall will not work on this thing. Oh, that sucks. So we can survive. We can survive another turn. But the token has zero attack. Yes! That's right. The token counts as zero attack. Wow. So you're going to summon Electro. That really sucks. When I don't have cloning out. Don't, don't target attack and receive, please. We just lost. I think we actually just lost. Um, what's the only chance we have? If we had cloning out, we literally would have won. We actually would have won if we had cloning out. Instead of attack and receive. Darn it, man. Should have went with the cloning. Should have went with the cloning. And I don't have any monsters, so paying life points. There's the other attack and receive. Yeah, we lost. Because Sergeant Electro can just target our other attack and receive now. Wow! All he had to do was target the other one. And we would have won. But that was like, that was that's literally our worst matchup, in my opinion. One of our worst matchups, in my opinion. Uh, is having built-in destruction with Harpy's Hunting Ground. is just too, too much. Uh, I don't think this wins us the game. He didn't even target it, which is great. So if he did lose, he, like, he deserves to lose right now. But he's not going to. Literally deserves to lose. I should have set cloning. Instead attack and receive. But that's like so... The one the one Sergeant Electro in this guy's deck. And he probably is too. Let's be honest. Who doesn't run? If you, if you run one Sergeant Electro, nah, sometimes you just run one. So we have a loss. We haven't had a dual one loss in such a long time. Like normally the first duel of our video, we win. Like... We've won every single time. Uh, of course, this is a challenge. This is challenge mode right now. It's like challenge mode Thursdays. But uh, we'll see what we can do. Traps only might not be might not be uh, might not be golden. It might not stay golden, boys. I really couldn't tell you. Tomorrow's theme. I have a really really cool deck that I want to see if I can get it off. Uh, it'll be so much fun if it does. All right. So we're going second, which I actually don't mind. I really don't like this hand. I run three Jar of Greeds for a reason. I like to open up with one, which we technically still can. I had a bite of the muffin. I'm the worst! Um, it's gonna set two back row and end his turn. Are you playing traps as well? I feel like you're playing traps as well. There's the Jar of Greed I was just speaking about. Now, I think one of those things, because because my luck is fan-freaking-tastic, I think one of those face downs is either gonna be straight flush or uh, Zing. They can target two face downs and say, hey, I, I almost guarantee it. I almost guarantee it. I really think the game, like, the ladder will, like, match you up against per worst. If, hey, you know that shady guy? Getting the worst match as possible. Let's see. We went with cloning. We're going to see stray lambs. Oh, that sucks for us. That definitely sucks for us because he's definitely going to go... Set, set. He's going to special summon these two tokens and then set his monster. Right? You're going to attribute both those to, spe to special set? I mean, to normal set? You're going to set a monster. I know it. You're going to set Dark Magician. This is you. Yep. Yep. Oh, man. Well, we do have cloning. Which is great. So we will have we will have our cloning out. We're going to get rid of Jar Grid right now because we just we literally have to. We literally have to. My turn is done. Ooh, Anubis. That could be good. Another Jar of Greed. It's actually probably more important. Uh, cloning is going to be when he flip summons it. 
we could go with like Enchanted Javelin because it's probably going to be a high attack monster. Yeah, I guess I'll go with Enchanted Javelin. It stinks that we're not seeing attack and receive like within the first two turns. I really That's think I, I, I'm purposely turn. playing these jars just Here because I, I think that attack and receive is the, is the, the way you win with this deck. Oh, it's just Dark Magician. All right. Give me that cloning. See, but now, like, watch. I feel like he's just going to be able to... I feel like... Oh, but we're going to be 2,900. So he needs an equip or reinforcements or something. Oh, no, we're not. We just copy him exactly. Never mind. Shoot. Oh, boy, I had fun. Imagine if he manages to get rid of this monster. And we could have actually... Uh, go, gotten the golden apples of 4,050. That would have been amazing. That would have been the strongest golden apple. We played two enchanted javelins. Oh, man. Well, that's pretty good for us right now. Because we're going to chain. Can we chain the other enchanted javelin? Oh, baby. <laughs> 12,000 life points. Have fun, man. Please have fun right now. I'm going to 12,000, just for a second. 12,100 life points. <laughs> I don't think I've ever gotten that high before. I don't think I've ever... Is this the deck of infinite life points or is it traps? I don't know. I do not know. All right, so you have two golden apples, which is fine because we can actually chain those. Uh, I'm going to set both of these and my jar of greed. Still no attack and receive, though. Still no attack and receive. And, like, the problem is, is that... I don't know. I don't know what the problem is, man. I don't know what the problem is. I couldn't tell you if, if, if I if I took my time to articulate my words carefully. I still couldn't tell you. All right, so he's got a Dark Magician here. 2,700. I love I love that we had over 12,000 12, life points. It's going to be, like, on the thumbnail, probably. Life point traps? I don't know what I'll call this episode now. I have no idea! I, draw a I have no idea. But I bit my lip like four days ago in a video and it's still swollen. I don't know if you guys remember when I bit my lip. It was like, ah, ah, ah! Slow motion everything. Oh, where's my straight flush? Where is it? Where is it? I really want my straight flush right now. All right. So Fatal Abacus, Abacus would be actually really bad in this in, in this matchup specifically. Uh, we're not going to have to be Jar of Greed. There's no reason to. There's no reason to. So let's go ahead and activate Golden Apples. I think we're going back above 12,000. I mean, we're going back, back about 10,000. This will probably be the strongest attack we can get. So let's go for it. Uh, put both of these in attack mode. Oh my gosh. This deck is so much fun. This deck is so much fun. And they're 2,900. Get wrecked. How are you getting over these? How the heck are you getting over these? These beautiful apple fiends. What do you even look like? I can't even see you. You're a malice token? 12,100 again! Which makes perfect sense because it took two enchanted javelins. Oh, there's our first attack and receive. Awesome. All right, so we can start winning now. There's a cloning, which I don't think I'll set. I guess I will set. I just won't set our um, embodiment. All right, what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to be super, super careful, guys. I, I, I might, maybe it's overly careful, but I'm going to switch one into defense mode just in case he has magical arm shield. I know that's, like, so unlikely, but I, I have to do it. I have to do it. Plus, if he has Windstorm, this plays around Windstorm. It's going to be Mirror Wall, though. That's fine. That's fine. We take some damage. We have, we have plenty of life points to spare. Let me tell you. We're still above 10,000. We don't leave 10K. So now let's see what you do here. How do you get over this 2,900 defense with a full trap and field? Full traps right now. Oh, well, you let that get destroyed. So you can play. Okay, I do have cloning. Is it worth it? Is he going to have another Ririoku? I guess that could be what he has. All right, we might as well play cloning. It does 200, it does 200 points of damage. Uh, and it gets rid of it gets rid of something. So you know what? It's fine. It's fine. No, I can either put this in attack mode. 
I'm afraid of Ribioku, then I go in defense anyway. Yeah, I guess we'll I guess we'll hard call the Ribioku. If I want an attack mode, then Dark Magician would have to attack into it. Or he'd have to trade with his rogue doll. Time to battle. Go, Dark Magician. So let's see what he does. He does that. Okay, so he's still just gonna do that. So he's definitely hard baiting me to attack into the rogue doll. Which means he probably has a second mirror wall. I use my face down card. Oh. My trap okay. Activates. Magician Circle. Maybe he doesn't have the mirror wall. Maybe he's just being silly. I mean, his field is really cool right now. If I was... It, listen, this is like the deck that I like. His field is really, really cool right now. I'll tell you what. However, uh, I think all we really have to do is attack into that Rogue Doll with our 2900 token, and we should win. Should being the key word. We could have cloning... Uh, well, cloning's only a normal end flip, so you can't do it on special summons. Okay, there's golden apples, just in case, just in case anything goes wrong. Uh, we'll have golden apples here waiting for us. Nine cards left in deck. These duels do take a pretty long time. We'll probably get three of them in today. But I like these duels. They're methodic. They're like doing a puzzle. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna play right into the second mirror wall. I'm gonna play directly into the second mirror wall. Worst case, I mean, well, best case scenario is just it's just a Karibo or a Windstorm. And I go back into defense. Let's see. Windstorm. Okay, so I, you know what? I really didn't believe you'd have the second mirror wall. With 30 cards in your deck, you're not having second mirror wall. So we'll end our turn here. And we might not even get attack and receive off, my friends. We might not even get attack and receive off. We might not have to. Well... What does he play? Mask of the Accursed. Actually going to screw us. We have 20 turns left now. <laughs> and it really doesn't matter. Uh, you know what I'm gonna do? I think I'm gonna have to be sneaky. I'm gonna have to be sneaky. I'm gonna I'm gonna summon my embodiment. I'm gonna summon my embodiment. Actually, I didn't have to do it this way. Shoot. I could have taken less. I could have taken less. I could have just summoned it on my turn and attacked into his rogue dial and taken 200 and then gotten the attack and receive off. Uh, but that was my fault. That's my fault. Don't do what I just did, guys. It's a pretty cool animation, though. My turn is done. Okay, he ends his turn anyway, so we got, to, we got the style on him. There's the other attack and receive. Ugh. Man. Okay. Time to battle. We'll go ahead and we'll do this. Just so we can activate attack and receive. So this should do this should do 900. So we have to activate two more traps with and, and we have to activate attack and receive. So I don't know how we're gonna do that. I actually think we might get locked down and lose. I don't see him summoning anymore. Wow, are we losing again? I still believe in my cards. I draw. I activate. Are we losing again? Oh no, he has an equips. Oh, it's just the mask of the accursed. Never mind. Oh, you know what we can? We have a chance. We do have a chance. We gotta leave a spot for straight flush. Straight flush is gonna be our salvation. Oh my gosh, I love it. I love that straight flush is gonna be our key to victory. I'm gonna flush Yugi right down the Swirly! Doesn't know what a swirly is. I don't know if kids still do that. All right, we're just gonna set attack and receive because we know we want that set. And we'll end our turn. Luckily, we have all these life points to spare. This is the longest duel of all time. <laughs> Oh, I love it, but this coffee's still warm. Oh, man. <clears throat> oh, my goodness. Uh, and then I can actually just straight up activate attack and receive. Now that I'm thinking about it, Mask of the Accursed is going to help us. This will do 200, 700, and he has 100 life points left. So all I have to do is activate a trap, and we win. I forgot about that. I'm silly. So, Mask of the Accursed... Uh, plus attack and receive will win us the game. So if we draw attack and receive, we draw Royal Flush, uh, straight flush, that'll win us the game. Um, we, have, we have many options. Or just a jar of greed to win the game. All right. I'll take it. You refuse to lose? Are you sure? Are you sure you, refu you, you refuse to lose? Because I don't really know what position you stand in right now that you get to, that you get to decide that. Because you lost. Down goes Yugi. Sounds like you got punched in the face five times. You have no regrets. Mask of the Accursed is the reason. Well, it's technically 
The only thing that kept you alive. All right, let's try to squeeze in one more. Those are some really long duels. Those are some really long duels, but uh, are, are is this deck golden? Is, is it the golden? Ah, you know what? This is the rubber band match, so we'll have to find out. If we win two out of three, maybe it's golden. Maybe it's golden. Of course, if you guys have any suggestions for other traps, let me know in the comment section down below. Uh, I'm not sure if I'll ever bring this deck again, but it's something I just wanted to feature real quick. Traps only. Uh, if you ever want to have a good time. <laughs> We've got the mirror match, boys. We actually genuinely have the mirror match. Oh, boy. All right, I'm going to set my Jar of Greed, my cloning, and I'm actually going to set Embodiment because I think we're going to have to go for a quick win right now. I think. If he's playing tra all traps as well, which I really hope he's not. I mean, he's got an extra deck, so I don't think he is. I don't think he's like me. I don't think he's. I don't think he's as sick in the head. He sets a monster face down, and sets a card. Uh, I'll activate Jar of Greed right now. Sure, why not? Just show him. Just show him. Bear witness to my power. I'm gonna chain this as well. Judgment Day. I guess I'll go in defense. We'll skip the animation this time. We've already seen it, boys. The music, though, when you get your special card is just intense. The intensity is real. Oh, my goodness. What do you do now? You set two? All right. What does that mean? Well, we drew another Jar of Greed, which is actually pretty good. Uh, we'll get through our deck faster. This way. And I really would like to set our mirror wall, but it's not an option. It is not an option. Let's just try to attack. Let's try to attack. What do you have face down, my friend? His is all... No! Chain reaction! It's the mirror match! What are the chances? What are the chances of that? And it's Pump Princess. Oh, boy. All right. All right. You're not a true Odeon. If you're not playing all traps, you're not a true Odeon. You're not. You're nothing but a poser. Is that going to be another Pump Princess? So cloning is basically dead on my side of the board. Cloning is basically dead on my side of the board. Oh, boy. Come on. Don't do this to me. Don't, 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 don't make my clonings dead. My other Jar of Greed. What is going on? All of those so early. Oh no! It's Panda Man! He's playing Panda. Come on, you're not even you're not even remotely close to being Odeon. Honestly. You really aren't. It's literally pathetic. It's literally pathetic. Where's my straight flush? Playing super defense Odeon. Oh, there it is! Alright, I'll look upon my Doom. I'm gonna activate my jar of greed. I'm gonna have you look upon your Doom. Please, I'm begging you. I'm begging you to set one more. Actually, you know what? Let's do this. Let's hope it's another Pump Princess. It's not. It's a Crass Clown. Shoot. Man. If it was another Pump Princess, I could have activated my, my, my Straight Flush right away. Okay. You're playing Sphere Karibo. I mean... I'm not going to play my cloning. It's only going to hurt me right now. Okay, hold on. Can I do it right now? Can I activate straight flush right now? Yes, I can. Woo! All right, activate straight flush right now. Get rid of this pump princess. Get rid of your other face down. I don't care. It was attack and receive. Sweet. All right, so we're going to take we're going to take a good amount of life points right here. Uh, a good amount. Wow! And he just mystic boxes me and returns his Karibo to his hand. That's broken. That was actually broken. That was actually broken. I should have just played my cloning. Alright, we're gonna go uh, Enchanted, ja uh, Enchanted Javelin and Windstorm. That's the only way we survive right now. Yo, we just got completely pro played. That was beautiful to watch. That was so beautiful to watch. It doesn't matter at the end of the day because like I'm 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 the true Odeon. I set my card face down. I I'm the true Odeon. Like this guy's a punk. He's 100% a punk. Okay, you're attacking with 1350. 
So I'm going to go ahead and enchant the Javelin. And I'm also going to Windstorm. We're going to Windstorm away. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. This guy's just such a poser. If he, even, even if he wins, it's like, wow, you're cool, man. Oh, you're so cool. All right, we're going to play Golden Apples and a Mirror Wall. As much as I want to play Mirror Wall and Fatal Ab 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 Abacus. Oh, come on. Really? You're going to be this guy? You're going to be Crass Clown? You're going to be you're going to be the Crass Clown. He literally is. It's all right, calm down. It's not a big deal. He's being fake Odian. It doesn't matter. Odian. 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 I don't care how you pronounce it. I could care less. Play a monster. I dare you. Why do I only have 850? He did that much damage to me? Oh, I lose. My monster's effect activate. Wow! Activate it, man! Alright, let's see what he attacks with. So we have to mirror... This is so funny. We have to mirror wall? And then we have to golden apples. That's amazing. That's amazing that that's our ticket to staying alive. Oh no, I forgot. Wait, but he gets cut in half. Take 25! Oh, he's attack and receive, doesn't he? Yeah, he, no, no, he has, what does he have? Oh, Labyrinth. Okay. Oh my gosh, too funny. All right, attack and receive, boys. We pretty much lose. He gets the he gets the crass clown me, dude. You're not even real. You're running this cheek that I ran. I've already done it. I've done it better. It's not entirely true, but we can pretend like it is. But but the, this is a great deck my opponent's running. It's pretty cute. Uh, I do hate that um that it's working. And then he just gets to, to poop on me. I mean, this deck only works. Uh, his deck is only working because I'm playing traps only. Traps only. But I do like his deck. Oh, you made a big mistake. Oh my gosh, this guy's such an amateur. Yeah, I'm gonna buff his panda up nonstop. I get it. I really do understand. Because I'm. What is that? What are you activating? Twister? Pay 500. I hope you lose right now. I hope you lose right now and I activate another cloning. Oh! have to think. Come out. I summon a monster. We have to put them both in attack. If we went into defense, the panda could make us lose right away. I think we lose no matter what, but still. Let's see how silly he is. Okay, he's not silly enough. Have we used another attack and receive yet? This ended up being the closest duel of all time. <laughs> That's not enough, is it? That's not enough. I think it only does 7, 9, 11. If we even have another attack and receive in the grave. Oh my gosh. He's going to live with 75? No. 375. He ended his turn? He can lose right here. He does lose right here. This guy's an idiot. Oh, we can't activate... That's like one of the only cards! We could have drawn almost anything else! Almost anything else! I set my card face down. Oh my gosh, I'm, I literally just broke a blood vessel in my head. Well, if we drew another attack and receive, we would have been screwed too. I guess a lot of our cards my would have been screwed. Is complete. I'm not out of options yet. My turn. Just summon, just tribute summon for some reason. Tribute summon. Tribute summon. Tribute. I set my car. Let's battle. You oh man. I really wish I knew exactly what other cards are left in my deck right now. Look at this. 175. One more stinking trap, and this guy, he didn't deserve to win. He ended his turn.
That's the way it goes sometimes. That was a lot of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it a lot. If you did, use the hashtag enjoyable in the comment section down below. With that though, I'm gonna get the hashtag out of here. Love you so much. Have yourselves a good day. But above all else, keep it shady.